Hey, who doesn't like a good story? Hi, I'm Laura Doman, helping you to tell your story well with a few tips from the entertainment world. People naturally perk up when they hear a really good story. Hey, it's edutainment, education, and entertainment. It's the easiest way to get somebody's attention and retain it. Campfire optional. There are several elements to telling a good business story. Grab them, show them, and then advise them. Mm, coupled with an interesting delivery, of course. First, you're going to want to grab your audience's attention. It's something that your viewers are going to identify with, and then you end up addressing in your video. It's called the hook. You might start with a question. Uh, people instinctively answer a question, even if they keep the answer to themselves. You might pose a problem, tell a funny story, or even mention a memorable event. Whatever it is, make it short and get right to the point. Next, show them. Surprise, surprise, how the hero of the story solves the problem. Oh, by the way, the hero is how the commercial scripts describe their main character, because the hero always wins. You're showing how the viewers can also solve their problems and win. Reap rewards. It's an overview of the benefits that you're going to be telling them about. You'll also stand a better chance of keeping eyes on your video when you let them know up front the reasons why it's good for them to keep watching. Reasons might be a better bottom line, perhaps more customers, fewer expenses, or a savings of time. It could be happier clients, employees, and management, or an improved workplace environment, or whatever the benefits are that are received from working with you. Then it's time for the nitty gritty of your video. You're going to advise them with detailed information or a demonstration of how or why your product or service works so well. It might be instruction on how to do something, like assembling a piece of furniture. It might be motivation to take action, even if it's to adopt a more positive mindset. And sometimes your objective is just to light a fire under your viewers so they realize they do have a problem. The icing on the cake is your delivery, just to keep them glued to their screens. I covered this topic in detail in an earlier video called Dynamic Delivery, but here's the gist. Be interesting to watch. Make sure you're engaged with your own material. Use pauses, tonal inflections, humor, whatever is uniquely you and fits the subject matter. Match the tone of your video with the subject also, whether it's expertise, confidence, enthusiasm. And enjoy talking to the camera. Calm your nerves and just have fun. So happy storytelling. Now, if you'd like to check out some more tips on how to be comfortable and more effective on camera, I've got a whole series on YouTube. And don't forget to subscribe so you'll be notified when a new one comes out. And if you'd like to have some one-on-one -on -one time, I'm happy to help. Just reach out. I can show you how to do it or do it for you. Same thing with voiceovers. So thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time with another tip on camera.